Good morning, all you boho daydreamers. This is Sally, the rainy day gypsy, and I am here in my atelier with Sheila of Boho Daydreams. You all know Sheila. She's my crafting partner. And she, you can see what we're going to do today. Actually, she is going to do a boho bead tutorial. Different than mine, she has a different technique, so I'm kind of excited to see how she does it. But stay tuned and we'll get ready. There's the Sapphire Mountains across the valley. Be back in a second. Hi everyone, it's Sheila from Boho Daydreams. Thank you, Sally, for the wonderful introduction. Oh, you're welcome. I'm excited to see what you're gonna do. Oh boy. Um, I'm really nervous, this is my first tutorial. <laughs> Don't be nervous. Oh boy. Is this my first real tutorial other than the um, washi tape that I made uh, about a year ago. Um, so we're go I'm going to try and actually make something this time. Um, well, if I can do it, you can do it. Oh yeah, you're, you're so crafty. <laughs> so these are the beads that I have created. I hope beautiful. I'm in screen. You're in screen and it's beautiful. So these are made with fibers. Mm. Um, and most of these, all but one, is made with fibers that I accumulate after I have cut up saris and torn those silk saris. I fight threads, so I've thrown a lot of them in the garbage. So Her vacuum cleaner is full. This, yes. These are her fibers from her saris. Aren't they gorgeous? It's like a little rat's nest here. But is. this is what you see in the wheels on Sheila's rolling chair. <laughs> in her cilia. When her chair no longer rolls, she knows it's time to clean up the threads. I do now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Aren't they yeah. pretty? All right. So the base of my, the base of these beads over here is is these straws. And these are just soda straws that my husband has accumulated. So I wash them and I cut them. I cut them up the center because I don't like them quite that thick and I haven't really found anything else yet that I can use that's as accessible as these soda straws. I think um, that makes them stronger too when you when yeah, you do that. Yeah, so they're much stronger. And then I tape them. So they're going to look like this. Um, and I tape them with the priority post tape. So hopefully priority post doesn't um, see this. Like because, come and arrest you? Yeah, really, because that's the last thing I need. I don't need to be arrested for crafting. I have enough, enough going on. So as you can see, um, well, now that I cut it, it's kind of like twisted in on itself, but it's a lot wider generally. So hopefully I'm not too close here. I'm using Sally's camera because my camera glitched so badly that I couldn't make a tutorial this morning. All right, so we have the straw and my base fabric as you can see, these ones here, you don't see the base at all. So you can use anything to just build a little bit of a base so that your fabrics will um, attach. So I'm gonna use some scrap, some scrap fabrics and I'm just gonna rip it up quickly. Um, I use sorry bits too, like these. If I'm going to have my, my um, my base showing a bit, I use these mm, my because they're colors. so pretty. And yeah. I, I have so much of this. These these are what, like, these are the pieces that you'll get in your um, fabric packages too, mm. when you, the embellish packages. I just tear, tear them up and give them to you because I accumulate so much of that. So let's see here. I'm going to cut this, tear it, and then we're going to start. And, and I use um, this glue here because this is what I have right now. The other stuff is still in a box somewhere and it's from Dreams Etc. And it is a really nice strong glue that dries clear. So um, it doesn't show through your fabric uh, light fabrics maybe a little bit, but um, it doesn't show through. Anyway, so that's what we're going to use. Mm, I love that. Yeah, it works. This stuff works really good. good. 
<laughs> Thanks, cells. I need, I need an extra set of hands. See, how would you do this without me? I don't know how I do anything without you. <laughs> you Fine. don't. You don't. She Thanks. really doesn't. Okay, it's good. Okay, thank good. you. Yeah. Let go. Let go of my bead. <laughs> I can't twist I here. I was concentrating. You're doing so good. All right. So I now just kind of wrap it up the bead. And I just keep everything on the straw because I don't know how long my bead is actually going to be. And it's easier to control. Mm -hmm. So I just kind of wrap it back and forth. And I kind of uh, stay, gravitate more to the middle. Okay. Less to the sides because I want my bead a little bit more bulky in the middle. Yeah. But that's just my preference. And there are a lot of bead tutorials out there. This is just me using my fibers and there's so many of you out there that have as uh, more more kits than than I have saved for myself so um, save the threads they are amazing amazing I should have uh... there are so many of, of our boho dre dreamers out there making boho beads oh my it's goodness. so much fun I love to see them I love it okay well I'm gonna glue it first and then I'm going to trim it back okay now, I have used muslin for this step at times, so you don't need to use a fancy. No, because this it is won't scrap. show up. This is just a scrap. Yeah. All right. So hopefully that tacks up quick. All right. So we've got our base. And I'm just going to pause you for a second so I can go into the rat's nest and pull out some fiber so you don't have to see that. All right, so I pulled out some threads out of that nest, and I also cut my wires, which I'm just gonna toss off to the side. And we'll talk about those later. These, these threads are so annoying. Oh my goodness. But they do make absolutely amazing beads. Yeah, they're pretty. Oh. I love all the colors that you get just wound around each other. Yes. All right, so here we go. Make sure I'm in frame. You're in frame. All right. So I'm just going to start winding them around. Hmm. Mm, some fat, some thick, some skinny. Yep. Yeah. yeah. And you just wind mm. and wind until you're happy. Oh my gosh, that purple is so gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? I just got my hand. Oh, I tell you, the glue. <laughs> Everything is sticking to me. That's These... when I wanted to take in jump off the cliff. Oh, no, that was the jump rings. <laughs> that was the jump rings. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. That was, yeah. I'm wearing my glasses today, so hopefully <laughs> there's going to be no issues. No issues. Okay, so let's see. Now, you can put as much on as you want of this stuff. Um, you, can, you can let the base show through if you want. If, you know, if you had some really pretty um, sari stuff that you wanted the base to show through. Well, that's kind of pretty, too. I mean, it was um, not the greatest sari stuff, but it's gold, which is kind of... Yeah, and that's just uh, the lining from one of the, the shirts that I cut up. Mm. Yeah, so I'm just going to add a little bit of blue. Add a little bit mm. more. I love Definite this color. boho colors. I love it. Yeah. Twist it around a bit. Probably needs a bit more. Purdy. These are my favorite colors. I do too. I love I that. I love jewel tones. I do too. I love that turquoise and aqua. I think aqua more than like the dark turquoise. All right. So let's see. How are we doing here? It's pretty. Are we covered? Probably. Yeah. All right, so we're going to check and see what our bead cap looks like on the end. That looks mm, good. That looks good. really good. All right, so I'm just going to cut this. I'm just going to cut that off like that. And looks like I'm unraveling a bit. I'm just going to tighten that back up. 
And, and they just kind of... Uh, they kind of just stick. Mesh into each other a they little do. or something. Yep. Okay. They do. So you don't need even glue at this point. Not at this point, no. Because you don't know if you're going to add a little bit more or not. Right. All right, so now I'm going to go to my wire. So I have pulled out some of this wire. And this is just a, a crafting wire. And I think it's a 22 gauge or 20 gauge. Yeah, 22 gauge. So this is a sturdy wire or sturdy enough to make your loops and whatnot. But there is a lot of wire out there. And I'm just going to quickly show you just a little bit of the different types of wires. Like you've got mm. a copper wire. Mm, those you've are got pretty. The, the brass and bronze looking wires. You've got silver wires. You've got, oh yeah, Sally, show them. You've got colored wires. I have this in purple and lime green. You know, who knew yeah. there'd be designer wires out there? Isn't exactly. that cool? Yes. My husband would laugh his head off. You know, and you've got the yellow brass wire. There's just so much out there. So I take a fair a fair length. About 12 inches, it looks like. Yep, probably. 10 inches, maybe. Yep. And I'm just going to make a little loop at the top and twist this around. Twist it around a few times. You have to be careful with some of this wire because it's really soft. If you twist too much, you're going to end up um, breaking. breaking the wire. Where did the little snippers go? Oh, there it is. I was, I was expecting it to look a little different. All right. So we've got the little end on it, the little loop-de-loop. -loop. And I'm just going to string a few beads on and see what, let's see, what do we want? Um, so we've got the bead cap. We've got that. Okay, so I'm going to add a bead to the top this time. Mm. Mm. I don't know if those ones... You're yeah, living, really living on the wild side. I am. I am. I am living on the wild side. I feel like I'm living on the wild side just making <laughs> a tutorial. Oh, this is my first one. I don't know if I said that to begin with, but it's really my first one. You're doing great. Oh, thank you. Um, a little bit of a nervous wreck. Are you? Yeah. At least oh, your yeah. hands don't shake when you get nervous like mine. No, I just say things oh, that are just that. Aw awkward things. I just say awkward things. I do too. Everyone does. All right, let's, I'm, oh, I am wearing, <laughs> wearing my glasses. Uh-huh. Yeah. And I still can't see. What is wrong? Okay. Let me make, make sure that's, yep. It covers up the ends beautifully. Oh, yeah. It does. Perfect size. All right. And so we're just going to add another colorful end to it. Love those. And this one. Are you going to do another bead like Oh, yeah. Thanks for the reminder. Yeah. You're yeah. living on the edge bead? I'm living, yeah, living on the edge bead that I forgot. Mm -hmm. Yes. Where is, where is that little... There we go. All right. So I'm going to tie this off. That's colorful, right? Oh, I love that. Is that one, is that one colorful? Yeah, it's oh, colorful. Okay. And it's got the uh, turquoise in it, too. Oh, good, because I can't really see it. I know. It. It's the light, I think. And then I'm going to tie this off. And I just make sure it's really tied tight, and I give it a few loops. There. I've given it a few loops off the camera. Oh, I love that. There. So let's just pop that up. So then I'm just going to nip this off. And this wire here, you could actually wrap it around if you wanted. I just don't want to. I don't want to <laughs> well, do Well, okay that. then. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, because I just don't want to. I'm just... The struggle is real to nip it as close as you can. All right, so there we go. Yes. So the beads are all from... I oh. have no idea, but these little... The little spacer beads, those came from um, Joann's. And these really nice little glass beads, they come from Hobby Lobby. Um, and then the other ones are just uh, larger seed beads, and I have no idea. But you can get those uh, at any store. Oh, absolutely. And the little bead caps you can get at about yeah, any store. Yeah, I don't know where I got those. Yeah. I might even have gotten those at Michael's. They might be oh, a Michael's okay. thing. I know I've gotten some on Amazon. All right, so now what we're going to do is add some, add some um, beads, and I'm going to string them on this wire. 
Um, hopefully it's long enough. I might have to cut a longer piece. I'm gonna string them and then I'm gonna come right back. Okay, so now that my fingers are all glued up um, and my little fibers are sticking to everything, I actually put these beads on and we're just gonna twist it around. Twist it around. So I start in the center and I twist myself up. And then I start just letting the beads fall randomly as I as I go. Mm, those beads are pretty. Yeah, these... I like those beads that I don't know uh, pearlescent or what are what do you call those that they have different colors in them. They pick oh, up all the different colors. Yeah, they're kind of like opalescent. Oh yeah, I don't know what that is, but I love them. Oh, yes, and of course I love that color. You just kind of like string over that, and you just let the beads fall where they want to. Just let them do their own thing. <laughs> you can always go back and add more. That's what that's what extra wire is all about. Yeah. If you didn't cut it long enough, that's okay. You just add another piece of wire. All right, so I'm going to now just make my losing beads. Make my way back up. <laughs> that's pretty. Just make sure that you've got them nice and tight. Like so it holds those fibers down too. Yeah, it's, yeah. You can always go back and just straighten things out. And then, there we go. Hmm. So, sometimes what I do with this, is I take and I bend it a bit and I just push it oh. into the bead. Oh, cool. So that way, yeah. it's kind of not gonna poke you. Yeah. So that's her bead. Let me see, how does it look when it's hanging? I love that. I love that. Now, what you can also do is go back and add another piece of wire and just kind of, uh, oh, sorry. You can keep adding fun stuff. You that's can, That's kind of yes. what's fun about it. Yes, just trying to get that in there. So I had another piece that I had cut. So I'm just going to go back and... And no beads on this one, just wire. No beads wire. on this okay, one, just gotcha. wire. Yeah. And I kind of string it tight. I kind of string this one really tight. Oh, okay. Yeah. And that just kind of holds everything together. It does. And it just adds a little bit of extra bling to it, mm -hmm. which is always really pretty. We love we love that. Yeah, we love bling. We do. I'm just going to try and tuck it in there. There we go. Okay, that's gorgeous. All right, so there Very we pretty. have one bead. And I'm going to make another bead. And I'm going to use a different fiber for it. I'm okay. going to use this. Ooh. Yeah, it's a sari fiber. Um, and we're going to make a quick one using that. Okay. All right, so I'm cool. just going to go that's... and cut the pieces. And then okay. I'll be right back. Okay. All right, I'm back. So um, we're going to glue up another base. Just because if you have anything that's going to show through, if, you, if your threads are kind of thin and you don't have a base, you're going to see uh, USPS priority <laughs> tape. They'll be like, and they will come around. They're going to come, they'll come after you. They'll be like, oh, are you shipping that somewhere? Yeah. Is that going to somewhere in particular? Oh, it's not? Well, it shouldn't be on your bead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, always looking out for you. Always looking out for you. All right. That's a pretty color. Oh, kind of emerald green. It is. It's very pretty. And this I just... Was, I'm making a bundle right now, um, Shades of Christmas. Oh. Yeah. And, and that green is in it? It is, mm. yes. Did you do the red skirt? I'm going it? to. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be adding some of that. She red has skirt. some of this stuff, you guys, that is just outrageous. So, I can't believe she sells it. All right. So I just cut off a piece anywhere in between. In between this stuff, I can't find the end. And so it is just going to be for beads anyway. So I'm just going to wind it up. Wind it all around. Oh, and that's got all colors too. Oh, it does. All those I, boho colors. It, yeah, I love this. 
I yeah, love this fiber. That stuff, that, that's almost like a gotta have. I love it. Um, I don't know where I, I don't know where I got it from. It's I know pretty. I have lots. Yeah. That's for sure. Because when I was looking for fibers um, yesterday to bring along. Yeah. You have uh, a ton of it? I do. Oh, I have lots of this. Okay, I'm coming over. Come over. <laughs> Come on over. See, you guys, I have access. She has access. I love it. Yeah. She knows where she knows where I live. I know where to go shop. Yeah. Come help me. Come help me. You've helped me so much. Right. Oh yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut this off a little bit. Don't need all of that. So that's our base. Um, and it holds pretty well. This glue is really good. So I already strung um some oops. We must cut the other end first. All right, so I already strung some. I'm getting caught up here. <laughs> Ooh, that's pretty. I strung some beads already, and I think I need to cut that end off a little bit more. We'll start at the other end. We'll start at this end. I just love those little blingy spacers. Do you think that that might be a little bit too dark? I might have to use Maybe. the... Maybe. Go the gold? Yeah. I'm going to go gold. Do the gold. Oh, look at all that. Go for the gold. Look at all that glue. Yeah. <laughs> all that freaking... Oh, I like that better. Okay. Yeah. Um. wonder if I should do this in this, if it might be more stable. Oh, boy. Oh, rather than have that much... Yeah, it'll go like up that. Up there. And then this one, it might be a bit stronger. Okay, whatever you say. I'm all about making it so it's not floppy. Yeah. Okay, yes. Oh, that's yeah. pretty. Okay, so we're gonna go on this end because the other end needs a little bit of help. Okay. Still. All right, so there we go. Okay, Look at that. Isn't I like that. that. Pretty? Mm -hmm. That's very pretty. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut that off a bit more. And we're going to pop. I'm going to go to her cilia and raid the strings off her chair wheels. <laughs> for, for real. Oh, my goodness. Is that the right one? No, no you need the colored I one. I need this one, yeah. I'm glad I have you here to tell me which one I need. For real. Seriously. I, I like telling people what to do. I'm bossing you around. It's good. It's good. All right. So is that? Mm. All right. So let's just tie like this it. off. You can't go wrong with uh, boho beads. Mm -mm. It just doesn't matter. They're always going to be beautiful. It doesn't matter what you do. They're going to be beautiful. Yep. It's just the colors. Yes. Um, it's because we're the boho world. That's yeah. why. We like color. We love the color. And, you know, any sort of bead, anything you want to, you know, there's no two ever alike because you get in your beads and you just kind of... All right, so there's our bead. Go crazy. Love it. Okay, so what are we going to do with that? What should we do? I don't know. Do, does it really need any... Okay. okay, I'm back. I am in hysterics. Look at the new boho bead over her little wound. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we oh needed gosh. some first aid. I think I was exsanguinating. And she winds it around her finger, and then she puts wire on it. I'm just on the floor. Oh, she's got All the right. boho bead fever. All right, so okay. we got that. Let's see if we need some more. Let's see. Do you think I should put some beads on that? Yeah, you need something. I don't know what it is. Okay, though. we need some beads on that? Sequence. Sequence? We can Let's try sequence. Let's do sequence. Okay, we'll okay. do sequence. Let's get sequence on the wire. Okay. We'll be right. right back. Okay. Oops, oops, oops. Okay, so I'm back. I strung some sequins that Sally brought me. Um, and this is what Sally brought me. She says, here. Here, I got this whole cup of sequins. <laughs> Pick out the colors you want. <laughs> I'm like, oh, you're kidding. I can't even see the holes. Can you not see I'm injured? I'm injured? <laughs> Honestly. Okay, we're going to see how this works. Maybe, maybe Sally, since I'm like a little bit one-handed, maybe you should try and string them around. Oh, okay. okay. I'm going to just trade places here. You okay. can sit down. If you need more sequins, go ahead. Gee, thanks. Yeah. Sit. Okay, so these, you know, you wouldn't want, I mean, I guess you could do them any way you wanted to, but 
I'm thinking spaced out for sure. Yeah, however you want to do them. Okay. I don't care. All right, so let's, what do you do, poke this in? I do, Ooh. I poke it, don't, don't do what I just yeah. did. <laughs> just have to come down a bit. Here? Yeah, there. Yeah. Okay. Now don't do, don't do what I did. Yeah, and then we'll have to have another boho bead on my thumb. <laughs> okay, we're gonna need to do more. Don't you think? Oh, come on. Oh, oh, <laughs> just a minute. <laughs> okay, I strung a few more uh, sequins on there. And I'm going to wrap my wire like this. And then I'm going to spread these out as I go. and kind of lay them flat. And spreading them out isn't easy for me with the beads either. What do you think? Oh, good. Yeah. Oh, see, I, then I pick it up and it goes back. You have to get really tight. Oh, and my wire keeps slipping around. That's what's going on. Yeah, I just left the wire on the roll. Good, good thinking. Because Sally's at the helm. I think it's just long enough. So we're just going to go shopping in your... <laughs> yeah, see, this is what she does. I'm on camera and she's behind me in my cabinet. <laughs> I'm just going to go shopping. Because <laughs> I love your old books. You won't like my prices. Okay. And I can see what do you think? Oh, I like books. that. Sheila, come see. Oh, oh, just a minute, just a minute. Be careful, your floor is slippery. Be like, oh look, yes. there's a head injury. Oh, no. you know I had a little cousin that died like that. Oh dear. Mm -hmm. Okay, what do you think? Oh, I like it. I like it. They need to be spread out, but you can work them around. Yeah, Ooh, I think exactly. that's pretty. I think that's really pretty. Yeah. Hold it up. Let's see, oh. Good. Yeah, really good, I love it. Okay. I love it. That is gorgeous. I okay, I like it. it. All those boho colors. Ooh, look at that one. Where's the one you just made? This one? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that one. I know, they kind of all blend together, right? Yeah, but and they're no all And no two so are different. the same. Yeah, that's what I like. All right. Okay, Thanks. is that it? That's are it. Are we done? We're done. Yahoo! All right. Thank you, guys. So much fun to be here with you today. Sheila has a little... Um, uh, what is it? A little logo thing that you're saying oh, yes. on your logo? Yes. That's sweet. Encourage, inspire, create. Yay, I love it. I love it. And be kind. Yes, always and be, be kind, kind and always have fun. Yes. All right. Thank you, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.